Hi friends, welcome to KVR Maths Academy. Today in this video, let us going to discuss first problem in exercise 14.2 in statistics of 10th class mathematics. Right? So before going to the topic, friends, please subscribe my YouTube channel, those who are not subscribed yet. Thank you. Yes, let us going to the topic. Yes. See, this is the first problem in exercise 14.2. The following table shows the ages of the patients admitted in a hospital during a year. The following table shows the ages of the patients admitted in a hospital during a year. Right? Find the mode and mean of the data given above. Compare and interpret the two measures of central tendency. Right? What we have to find? Mode mode and mean of the data given Compa and we have to compare and interpret the two measures of central tendency which means mode and mean see here table what has given as in years has given and number of patients 5 to 15 15 to 25 25 to 35 35 to 45 45 to 55 55 to 65 ages has given like that Next number of patients, 6, 11, 21, 23, 14, 5. See which means, 6 number of patients of age between 5 to 15. Right? 11 patients of age between 15 to 25. Similarly, 5 number of patients age in between 55 to 65. So, for this table, we have to find the mean and mode. Mean and mode. So let us find. So first, uh, I'll draw the tables according to the problem. Right? See, I have drawn the tables of uh, mode and mean. See, this is the table belongs to mode and this is the table belongs to mean. Right? Yeah. So this is mode. As in years, I have taken like this. This is also called as CI, close intervals. Next, number of patients, uh, frequency. Right? Next, here, mean. Mean in direct method, I will find, right? So that's why I have taken a phi xi. Right? Yeah, so first to find mode. Right? So what is the formula for the mode? Formula for the mode. Mode. So z is equal to mode, z is equal to what is the formula? Yes, L plus F1 minus F0 by 2 F1 minus F0 minus F2 into its height into its height right yeah so mode is z is equal to l plus f naught f1 minus f naught by 2 f1 minus f naught minus f2 into height here what is f1 f naught f2 h and l let us find from the table see here first uh, find f1 f1 means model class f1 means Model class. What is a model class? So highest frequency is called model class. This is. So highest frequency is 23, no? So this is F1. Highest frequency is called model class, right? Next, what is F0? Frequency of the class preceding the model class. Frequency of the class preceding the model class. So this is F0. So in the same way, F2 means, yes, frequency of the class succeeding the model class. Frequency of the class succeeding the model class, this is F2. So F1 is 23, F0 is 21, F2 is 14. Next, what is L? Lower boundary of the model class. Lower boundary of the model class, which is corresponding in class interval. So here, 35 is the L. 35 is the L. Next, what is H? H is? Yes. The difference between lower boundary and upper boundary of the class. So, 15 minus 5 is 10. So, here write down L is equal to, L is equal to what? Yeah. 35. L is equal to 35. F1 is equal to 23. F, F0 is equal to 21, F2 is equal to 14, and height is equal to H, length of the class, model class. 
so the in class interval height is equal to how much yes 15 minus or 45 minus 35 is 10 so now substitute mod is equal to mod z is equal to l l means how much yeah 35 plus this is f naught first f1 no f1 is 23 minus f naught is 21 by 2 f1 2 into 23 minus 21 minus f2 is 14 into its height 10 right that is equal to 35 plus 23 minus 21 is yes 2 by 2 23 is a 46 46 minus 21 minus 14 is minus 35 so 46 minus 35 is yes exactly 11 so into 10 that is equal to 35 plus 2 tens are 20 by 11 20 by 11 20 11 11 ones are 11 next uh, 9 is there put point and 0 11 8 ja 88 2 is t is there 0 put 11 ones are 11 so that is 35 plus this is how much 1.81 up to two decimals and up that is yes 36.81 36.81 this is the mode of the given data right <coughs> yes next term uh, here what is the formula for mean mean x bar is equal to mean x bar is equal to indirect method sigma fi xy by sigma fi right yeah sigma fi means this one sigma fi how much add 6 plus 1 7 8 8 plus 3 11 15 20 2 is there 2 plus 1 3 3 5 7 8 80 sigma fi is equal to 80 so how can you get fi xa uh, first class marks write down class marks means this is the average of class interval or midpoint of class interval right yeah so 5 plus 15 20 by 2 is yes 10 15 plus 25 yes 40 40 by 2 is 20 similarly this is 30 this is 40 50 and 60 so these are the values of xi right yeah fi xi is equal to multiply these both 6 tens are yes 60 11 20 is a 11 2 is a 22 220 3 0 is there 3 1 is a 3 3 2 is a 6 next 0 4 3 is a 12 1 is there 4 2 is a 8 so 9 0 is there 5 14 is a 70 next 0 6 5 is a 30 so sigma fi xi is equal to how much here these are 0 this is 0 6 plus 2 is 8 11 11 plus 2 13 1 is there 1 plus 2 3 3 plus 6 9 9 plus 9 18 18 plus 10 is 28 2830 sigma fi x is equal to 2830 so substitute 2830 by this is 80 0 0 get cancelled right 283 by 8 283 by 8 divide 2 3 8 4 is a 8 3 is a 24 4 3 8 5 is a 40 next 3 is there right yes 0 put and point put 8 how many times 8 3 is a again 24 next 6 0 8 7 is a 56 right 4 is there 35.37 this is 35.37 so here mode is 36.81 and uh, mean is 35.37 has come right mode is 36.81 and mean is 35.37 now finally what has given in question right interpretation also compare and interpretation also he has given no so let us write up interpretation interpretation right up right uh, therefore maximum 
maximum number of patients joined joined in the hospital are 36.31 while an average average is of patient admitted in the admitted in the hospital is how much is 35.37 see interpretation maximum number of uh, patients joined in the hospital is or 36.81 this is why because it is mode now so maximum number of patients this is mode next term uh, while an average is of patient admitted in the hospital is 35.37 why because it's mean that's why average is we have taken understood clearly yes note it down okay friends if you like my video please like and share don't forget to subscribe thank you thank you very much